Hello, Robbie, it's Grandma. What do you want? I'm calling to check in on you and your grandfather. Oh, how sweet. I'm sure that's genuine. <laughs> yeah, we're uh, doing fine. Thanks for... Thanks for caring. Are you enjoying having him over for the week? Yeah. Well, not that you actually genuinely care, but yeah, it's been pretty nice. We've gone to some events and... and did, that, you know. Did you enjoy the concert? Yes, we enjoyed the concert. I'm not going to ask how you know about it, because I'm sure you've been stalking us and following us. I, I put a microchip in your grandfather's head. Of course you did. Um, um, yeah. Pretty sure he's going to want to hear about that, so... You enjoyed watching Cher? Yes, the Cher concert was fun. And you saw Bono, Bono there, there, didn't yes. you? Yes, we did. Why? You know everything we already did, apparently, so why do you bother? Well, I just thought we could have a little chat, you know. Well, I don't, that sounds like the worst idea <laughs> I've ever heard of. Did you enjoy going antiquing with your grandfather? Yes. For, as a matter of fact, it did. Did you get a nice, por did you get a nice porcelain clown? Okay, how do you... Those are really specific details, just from knowing the location of somebody through a chip. So you had to have been spying on us. That was just a lucky guess. Oh, it was a good. It was a good. It was a good guess. So anyway, um, if we're if you're done, Robbie, did you enjoy the parade? Yes, I enjoyed the parade. Robbie, was there anything odd about that parade? No. Are you sure? Yeah. No. It was other than it was off, out of season and not. Tied to any holiday. Robbie, let me ask you, were there rainbows everywhere? Yeah. Were there men I'm, just, I'm assuming that's just because it was a Irish Ameri American Heritage Pride Parade. No, Robbie, no. Because Grandpa's Irish American. <laughs> Robbie, your grandfather's German. Oh, he could be half Irish. Ugh. It's gotta be Irish somewhere. Well Robbie, were there men were there men dancing around in leather? Yeah. So, the, so what if there was? Were there some women possibly wearing flannel holding hands? Yes, yeah, sleeveless flannel, but I don't see what you're getting at here. Robbie, it was a gay pride parade. No, it wasn't. It was not a gay... You just assume because there's rainbow flags and there's sort of mannish looking women and sleeveless flannel holding the hands of other women and then half-naked men in leather dancing on top of, you know moving vehicles that it's suddenly gay. Oh, it's suddenly gay. Okay, you know, Robbie, let me ask you this. What song was playing? I don't know. Uh, Something sort of dancey and techno-y to get everyone in the mood for Irish heritage. <laughs> Robbie, how many Irish people did you actually see at that parade? I don't know, but I saw a lot of Irish-looking gentlemen, so... Did you see a man dressed like a leprechaun, possibly quite short, maybe wearing leather chaps? Yeah, of course I did. <laughs> that there wasn't a leprechaun, that was a midget dressed in leather. No, it wasn't. Whatever, Robbie. It was Robbie. an Irish... It was a leprechaun. Okay, Robbie, well, what's your grandfather doing right now? He's... He and Julio were chatting it up in the back. In uh, my bedroom with the door closed. Oh, God, they're in your bedroom? Oh, jeez. Yeah, they're just... Last I checked, they were sitting on the bed. Oh, by the way, Robbie, did you get the paperwork I sent you? Swirling around each other's arms with their fingertips, and then they oh. closed the door. Oh, what? God. Robbie, did you get the paperwork I sent you? Yeah, I did. It went straight in the trash. I'm not oh. calling for that again. No more paperwork. Well, fuck you too, Robbie, you fucking yeah, fuck pussy. You, fuck me. Fuck me. Right, fuck you too. Robbie, you're a pussy. That's all you'll ever be. That's great. You're like your pussy so, grandfather. Are you done, or can I go now? <laughs> Go check on your grandfather. No, I'm not going to go check on him. He's busy. Robbie, how much do you like your bed sheets? I... That's the strangest question. Just came out of nowhere. I don't even know how to respond. Well, you either yeah, like them fine. or you don't. They're comfortable. What? Well, you either like them or you don't. Mm. They're... I don't even know if I want to answer this, but yeah, they're... They're comfy. Oh, you're gonna have to change those bed sheets. <sighs> Robbie, go check on your great father. No. Go check I'm on your grandfather. Go, go for a walk. Robbie, go check on your fucking grandfather. No. Yes.
I don't need to fuel your gay grandpa paranoia. <laughs> little, your stupid little... Robbie, watch who you call it stupid. Little con your little conspiracy theory ends today. Conspiracy theory, my ass. That's about to be conspiracy theory all over your pillow. That is, just, that is crude. You're just trying... I'm not playing around with this anymore. Julio right? took my man. I'll tell you what, if you stop calling every two seconds, <laughs> I'm tired of, you've called me 20 times a day and I've hung up on you every time. I'm tired of this. Promise just to leave me alone for 24 hours. Okay, fine, Robbie. Go okay. check on your grandfather and I won't I'm call you to, again until, I don't know, Tuesday. Okay. Okay, fine. Go check on your grandfather. Okay. Hold Let's on. see. Jesus Christ. Worse than the 9-11 truthers with this. Oh, shut up, Robbie. Um, Hello, Robbie. Welcome back. Well, yeah. what, what were your grandfather and Julio doing? They, um, I couldn't quite, they were just talking, I, I didn't really see, they were... Robbie was Julio on top of Grandpa. Grand <laughs> Grandpa's gay. Yes, Robbie, Grandpa's gay. Okay, that's, that's fine. Robbie was Julio on top of Grandpa. I didn't really get a good look. Um, was Grandpa possibly screaming into a pillow? I may have burned the image in my brain, like a photograph. What do you, you got, know, What do you do with those bed sheets, Robbie? I. Um, I'm probably just gonna go ahead and give him to Grandpa as a parting gift. Well, because Robbie, I guess I was right. You are. Come on, Robbie, say it. I want to hear you say it. Grandpa's gay. Oh, that's a good feeling. Hold on. Let me play that. Let me play that back on my tape recorder. Grandpa's gay. Grandpa's gay. Oh, uh, <laughs> Miss Fifi, you shush up. Just why shut up. You, why couldn't you just give me my? Why couldn't you just give me my? Miss <laughs> Miss Fifi, you leave why my mailman alone. Miss Fifi, leave the mailman alone. Oh, was that Robbie? I couldn't hear you. Why couldn't you just let, let me have my ignorance? Uh, because that's no fun. I enjoy destroying your life. <laughs> Miss Fifi, you leave the mailman alone. Oh. <laughs> well, Robbie, Grandma's got to go. I'm going to go, um, I'm going to go, <laughs> I'm going to go play long darts. With the neighbors. You're gonna do what? I'm gonna go play lawn darts with the neighbors. Bye bye, Robbie. Bye bye. Have fun with your gay grandpa. Thank you. <laughs>